my religion kept my sanity. It didn't stop me from being scared by any means. Not, nobody really wants to die. But I figured if the Lord wanted me to die on this particular island, I would, and that was the end of it. I just felt it was my duty to do that. I enlisted. I was 17 when I enlisted. Basic training. I was at Paris Island. I was a corporal in the Marine Corps. I was in the Pacific for two years. Okay. We were in. We landed in Japan before the armistice was signed, and we went into Japan fully armed because we didn't know what was what was awaiting us. Mm -hmm. I was on three different islands in the South Pacific. Just went in and more or less cleaned off the islands and took possession of them, that's all. My responsibility was communications. I was in headquarters company and we had to provide communications with all the rest of the division. This whole country pulled together. They just cleaned together. It was a wonderful thing to see how much people sacrificed and did during the war for this country. We are working like hell in the old hometown. We're working in the old hometown. Working in the old home. We were on Guam. We're, we got in our replacements, all our equipment. We were aboard ship in Guam to invade Japan when they surrendered. Okay. That's where I was. Okay. We were we were very glad that it, they surrendered, because mm -hmm. otherwise we'd have suffered a tremendous amount of casualties if we had to invade Japan. Battleship Missouri, 53,000-ton flagship of Admiral Halsey's 3rd Fleet, becomes the scene of an unforgettable ceremony marking the complete and formal surrender of Japan. In the Bay of Tokyo itself, the United States destroyer Buchanan comes alongside, bringing representatives of the Allied powers to witness the final capitulation. I learned to keep my mouth shut. Well, that's a pretty loaded question. Hmm. Well, freedom is to, to be secure, to not have any fears about what your neighbor's doing, or to voice your opinion of the government, good or bad. Freedom is something that it's not free by any means. It is something that has to be worked at. They have carved a niche in military history and in the hearts of proud Americans.